coming to the next concepts on nitrogen rule and high resolution mass spectrometry which is also abbreviated as hrms looking first at uh, nitrogen rule now nitrogen rule is also another very useful rule to predict uh, the presence or absence of nitrogen in the organic compound and also if nitrogens are present whether they are present in even numbers or whether they are present in odd numbers now the origin of this rule comes from a few observations with respect to the mass number as well as the atomic number for nitrogen now if you look at nitrogen itself nitrogen's most stable isotope happens to have a mass value of 14 which is even but when you consider the valency of nitrogen nitrogen has valency of 3 that is odd and that is something very peculiar to nitrogen in the periodic table and no other element and that's what resulted in formulation of a rule which states that if the mass value of the organic compound is odd then it contains odd number of nitrogens if it if the mass value or the molecular weight of the organic compound is even then the organic compound either contains even number of nitrogens or no nitrogens that is what is the summary of nitrogen rule you can pick up examples of compounds which have nitrogen uh, which have no nitrogen which have odd number of nitrogens and even number of nitrogens and it will all fit into this rule wherein the molecules which have odd number of nitrogens would have an odd mass value uh, molecules which have even number of nitrogen or no nitrogen at all would have an even mass value uh, coming to hrms hrms is a fairly recent uh, development with respect to mass spec and it can give you uh, the molecular weights up to fourth decimal place of an amu and the major major application is that if at all you have two different compounds which have uh, very similar mass values but you want to discriminate between them you want to identify which of the two compounds you are analyzing with the help of a mass spec even if they are different uh, in a fraction of an amu that can be picked up by the hrms and you will be able to know which molecule are we exactly talking about so that is the application of high resolution mass spectrometers